somebody here on my way. Hello. <laughs> Hi, beautiful people. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. If today is your first time here, my name is Stella. If you have not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share my videos. Click on that notification bell to get notified whenever I post any new video. And for my returning subscribers, you guys are the real MVP. Thank you guys for the love. Thank you guys for the support. Honestly, I really do appreciate it. So in today's video, I'm going to be vlogging. I don't know if I should call it vlog. It's vlog anyway. I'm going to Bradford. Yes, I'm going to Bradford. And I'll be taking the bus. Like, I can't remember when last I took the bus, honestly speaking. I think since last year it's more than a year plus down my husband is not around nobody to drop me me and i can't pay for taxi because taxi is very expensive from huddersfield to bradford is going to cost a lot so i was like you know what i'm going to walk down to bus station and then take a bus and go for this induction i mentioned this company on my youtube so this company i've been talking to them for a while now because they got my cv on indeed for those of you that don't know i'm a healthcare assistant i have i have a permanent job but the reason why i'm going for this company is because they are recruiting senior carers and they pay way more than where i work now and i mean this is new year and i was like okay i think i should just give it a try and try another company because where i work now i've been working there for more than three years plus or four years now this particular uh company i work with, i've been working there for a long time sometimes i pick shift anyways from agency but that's um company i work for i have been working with them as a staff and i've been working with them for a long time so i decided to like uh, try this company and if they are willing to you know pay me way more than where i work so why not so why not try another company to be honest and i heard that they pay well for senior care so yeah that is the position i'm going for if they are going to pay me more honestly i'm going to like uh stop working where i work now like i said i've mentioned this company on my youtube channel so yeah i'm going there because they got my cv online they got my cv online and i had my interview a few weeks ago so today i'm going for the induction but if they're not you know offering me what i want i will still not work with them i mean like i have a job but i'm just looking for a better but i'm looking for a better pay nobody's tying me down like i told you guys i've been working in this particular company for a long time almost three years plus or four in fact i think it's time for me to try other places and see what it's like so guys i'll be vlogging like i said i'm going to be walking down to a uh, bus station so i'm super happy that the weather is so good because this past few days the weather has been something else it, it has been snowing rainy you know like bad weather uk weather you guys know what i'm talking about like if you're in the uk you understand what i'm trying to say let's go to bus station like i said i'm going to be vlogging i'll show you guys what breakfast city looks like today yeah let's go guys i'm so happy that the weather is so beautiful and lovely today to be honest because ah, when it's bad eh? when it's bad it's bad and like you not enjoy it at all so like a yeah, beautiful day so yes let's go to bus station oh Because the weather is always bad like it's always bad and if it's bad like to just make you just spend unnecessary money because anyway you're going to you want to pay taxi you want to you know or you end up even staying at home but yeah today it's not too bad and I can't remember the last time I went to Bradford honestly I think is <laughs> I think it I think it's more than two years the last time I went to Bradford should be <laughs> when I went to church Cause i can't remember when i went to bradford last honestly but i know it's more than two years because before i used to go to church in bradford my church my church is winner so i used to attend winner chapel in bradford before so until we now have a branch here in huddersfield so yeah as at that time we used to have a bus that would pick us from this place and take us to bradford so the last time i went to bradford was two years ago so going there today i just feel like I'll feel different I think I'll feel different so okay oh, let me keep working oh I'm happy that the weather is good today if not then this is my worker I will not like it so I saw somebody here on my way hello good morning <laughs> yeah so it's time for us to gist right <laughs> Like for like four 
I can't believe it. Yeah, two years in the relationship, I proposed to this girl. Four, I don't know if we talk about this on my YouTube. Four years. I don't, I don't mind. I'll, I'll I bring out time. Yeah. So that we'll so talk about it. Talk about it. So I don't mind. I don't mind to share my experience, my yeah. journey, how everything went down the drain right before my eyes. Like, oh my I was God, crying. this is unbelievable. For like two months. I was Imagine after all this money you spent bringing her to the about the money. Look, look yeah, but money is involved, my guy. I was, you know, I spent my time. Hey! Love. Yeah. Is even more than the whole money I spent. I know, you understand? I know. Because this relationship will actually cost me a lot of commitments, you know? Yeah. In terms of money, in terms of time. time. So guys, the guy I met was my brother's friend. They came in together in 20, 20 what? Is this 2021? Yeah, they came in together in 2021. So he brought his wife last year and she left him. But anyways, he said he's going to share his story on my YouTube channel so that he'll tell people what's really happening. So if you're bringing your girlfriend, your partner, so that you're careful. But anyways, we're going to share that on this YouTube channel. For now, I'm waiting for my boss and I don't know when the bus will arrive, but I will just have to stick around and wait for my bus to arrive. This is our train station. Let me show you. Let me turn the camera. So yeah, that's our train station. When you just go in there, yeah, to take you to where you see different train. And these are all bus stands. All the stands you can see. These are bus stands. So yeah, this is my own bus stand. So I'm waiting for my bus. If you walk down there. The bus station is around the corner, but I don't want to go to the bus station because there's no point of me going to the bus station. I'll, I'll just stay here and wait for my bus. Can you see what it said? Bus town. So that's a free bus. And this is bus going to Bradley. But for me, I'm going to Bradford. This is Bradley bus. A few moments later. So guys, that is my bus coming. You can see that's Bradford bus. And at the same time, I just realized that I was chewing gum throughout this vlog. I am really, really sorry. Please forgive me. Honestly speaking, I didn't even like realize I was chewing gum or I didn't realize how bad it was until when I was editing this um, vlog. So I'm sorry. So anyways, fast forward. This is my boss. I'm about to pay for my um, tickets. So yeah, I just paid. I'm going upstairs. When I'm taking the bus or when I used to take the bus, I like staying upstairs because it's more relaxing. There's not too much people. If you're in the UK, you know what I mean now. There's not too much people. You just stay comfortable, especially if you're making that ninja call that is on ending call. As I then, I like to call my mom, especially when I close from work. So yeah, I like to sit at the top. So I don't know what happened to the record. I was just trying to show you guys that yeah, I bought a day ride and a day ride cost I think it's four pound fifty or five pound. I can't remember honestly because I used my credit card to make the payments. So at this point we are leaving Huddersfield town. We are heading to Bradford. So this is also a small town between Huddersfield and Bradford. So if you're studying in Bradford, you can also live in uh, this small town because it's not even far from Bradford. So I'm almost in Bradford. I mean, in fact, I also call this place Bradford, but it's not really Bradford. Yeah, so that's what I mean when I say people should check out smaller towns. Like sometimes all these big cities are very, very expensive. But I mean, if you have the money and you can afford the rent, why not? Go for what you want. I'm in Bradford Interchange now. I'm just looking at my Google map so that I know where exactly I'm going to. So this is the hustle, guys. 
this is the hostel it says 10 minutes work so it says 10 minutes work so i'll have to figure out where i'll be going now i'm kind of lost here so it says 10 minutes work so i'll be using my google map to sort myself out so guys yeah this is bradford interchange it's also known as bradford uh, bus station and at the top you can see that the picture so that's where you see where you're going to like say if you're going to manchester and all of that you're going to see it there and it will tell you the stand where you stay that's something i love about this uk honestly it's self-explanatory so yeah so guys we're out of the bus station so this is bradford interchange this is outside and like say if you want to take taxi there's taxi outside so it's super easy to locate where you're going to if you don't want to walk like me you just take taxi outside so this is what interchange look like So I think it was drizzling before but I'm happy now that it's not so bad in fact it's not even raining it's not drizzling so but I'm just happy that the weather is not as bad as I thought because if it's raining or drizzling I don't have choice but to take taxi and I mean your baby girl don't want to spend money I don't want to spend money I'm on tight budgets I am on tight budgets I think I'm freezing now <laughs> look at my hand because I need to be you know looking at where I'm going to because I'm using Google map I beg let me do it today African style and run I can see a saloon African saloon here or African store I don't know African stuff. Well, yeah, you see, using my Google Map. Using Google Map can be challenging. I'm not even going to lie because it can be confusing, kind of. guys we finally located the place he's upstairs so i need to sort my i don't even know where to okay, i think this is the upstairs okay so guys that has been just keeping myself busy you know looking at myself because honestly the people i saw there i was not really expecting all of that but yeah it is i'm behind me you can see so many things there yeah that is what they use in teaching people especially for those people that don't have experience they'll teach you how to use hoist how to use wheelchair and if you want to do some training for first aid you know that's the dummy there they teach you how to first aid that's just Two it thousand years later so guys we're done it was it was not what I expected, but I am done. 
but yeah that's just it for today i am heading to um the bus station but yeah i am in bradford today so guys because i was vlogging this is the train station no <laughs> not bus station so i think the bus station is just right behind there <laughs> i i <laughs> got stella oh vlogging oh vlogging oh this was like when you're vlogging and you know you will not concentrate and at the end of the day these are the kind of things that happen this way is the bus station so i went to the train station i'm kind of confused <laughs> i was just going somewhere else but anyways i'm in the right place now i'm at the right place So guys i'm just on my stand and it says my bus is coming in 10 minutes time you all know it's like taking the bus now so guys i missed my bus i'll have to wait for 10 more minutes to get another bus so it's like every 10 minutes you get the bus so that's how it works here so yeah i just missed if i just missed one now so i'll just stick around let me go and sit down and just you guys what happened about this induction and tell you guys what is like so guys this induction honestly it was not what i expected and i don't even know if i'm going to work for them because when these people called me they were like oh they were just assuring me so many things blah 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 and normal one thing that attracted me there was the pay you know i was like ah if they will pay me that amount of money ah, i don't mind working for them honestly that was the main you know reason that i had to come to this Bradford but on getting to this place I don't think it's what you know they said but whatever that happens it is what it is I'm already here in Bradford I finished the induction but honestly I did not really in fact I don't know what to say but yeah I decided to just vlog to show you guys what Bradford looks like and I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog please well with this we've come to the end of today's video if you find this vlog interesting and fun don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like subscribe and share my videos because i'm going to end this vlog now and wait for my boss i need to concentrate and wait for my boss because i don't want to miss another boss again i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys <laughs>